how Deborah was killed by her fellow students of Shegu Shagare College of Education in Sokoto. Deborah and her fellow students have a WhatsApp group where they solve their academic problems. Any kind of difficult questions you don't understand can be thrown into the group. Someone that knows will provide the answer. So Deborah found out that that group was not used according to what it was created for. As in, the group was turning into something else and she sent a voice note, which I will play after this. Those students found that voice note annoying that it was a blasphemy. Deborah spoke against Muhammad. She came to school the next day and they bounced on her after much pleading, yet they did not spare her. They killed her, burnt her alive. I will play the video that you guys can watch how she was killed, how one guy or two guys there we are, we are so proud of what they did. Holy Ghost fire, but I put the zero for Aruda. Do all the new ones who have won the Ekamata Kutura, but where are you group in the room to the to the Abu Bon Banzabanifa? In translation to that, she said, Holy Ghost fire, nothing will happen to us. The group is not created for sending nonsense things. It is created to send past questions. If there is test or if we are given assignments, not all these nonsense things, which can profit nonsense profit. In as much as everybody condemned their arts, please, I would like to state this. Anywhere you are, any state you are in, they said when you go to Rome, you behave like Romans. When you go to Europe, you behave like Europeans. And when you go to Russia, you behave like Russians. What am I trying to say in essence? Please try and know the culture. Try and know their doctrine. Try and know their way of life in any place you are. Glory, um, Deborah, being in a Muslim state, I don't know if she's a Christian or a Muslim, should have been conversant or should have known that they don't joke with their Prophet Muhammad. They don't joke with religion. They don't dare speak anything against Prophet Muhammad because they consider it as blasphemy. Sad to say that she has to go this way. Rest in peace, Deborah. Um, please let this sound a note of warning and let everybody learn from this incident. Learn how to breathe in your mouth. Say things when you need to be said and just walk up past when you need to walk up past. If you're watching for the first time or you have been following along, you have not yet subscribed, you just bumped into this wonderful channel, you are welcome. Remember to hit on the subscribe button to subscribe to this wonderful family where every information has been passed on celebrity gist, celebrity gist, trendies, documentary, all the apropos gist show for you on this channel. And remember, weekly upload is always assured here and it's imperative you turn notification bell to always get a lot of my new videos whenever i drop them thank you all for watching stay tuned as i'm signing out for my next video bye bye love you all